ever since Alinsky's death, he's been on a trajectory that I think that this will just push forward even further. You know what I mean? Yeah. Or he's just, I keep saying it, but he's just never going to be on the wrong side again. You know what I mean? Right. This, is, this unit is his family. It's everything to him. These people are everything to him. And I just, I, I think, you, you know, it's just, those bonds just get strong. I guess is the best way I can answer that. Um, so could you both talk a little bit about how you think your characters have evolved since we first met them? Because I think we've seen change from both of them. Oh my God. Right? I've, I've gone through two fiancés. Right. <laughs> I've dated literally every girl on the show except for Rojas. I even went on a date with Platt. <laughs> <laughs> I did. I forgot about that. I shouldn't yeah. probably say it like that. But you did. I went on a date with Platt, which was which makes complete sense. I don't know. <laughs> Can you talk? Um, I mean, I've certainly gone through character changes. Uh, I used to be sort of <laughs> joyous and bubbly, and yeah. um, I think now she's sort of not hard, but like you know, tougher, a lot tougher. Which I think is good. It's good for a cop. I think too. You know, we in season five we got a new showrunner and a new directing producer, and. Uh, they decided to take the show in a bit of a different direction. A little you know darker. I mean? A little darker, takes itself a little more seriously. You know, they're, what they've said is like, they want it to be the closest, the closest to the wire that broadcast can be. Yeah. That network broadcast can be. Yeah, I don't think season one and two Burgess would fit in this world so well. So I yeah. think it's important that she grew with the show and I'm excited by it. I mean it was it was you know, I miss the old the old Burgess, but you know, there's there's you still see some of that like in the lighter moments. Yeah, but I I, I, I appreciate that our tone is a little bit more straightforward, you know what I mean? Like we'll crack jokes and the to make the characters laugh, but it's not the jokes aren't for the audience. Yeah. You know what I mean? The, yeah. jo the jokes are for the characters communicating with one another. We're not trying to we're not trying to have funny moments. And I I kinda like that. Yeah. I mean I miss having the funny moments. They were fun to toy around with. But I think that uh, they've just streamlined our product in a way that I, re I really appreciate that. I, I it's it's a show that I don't know, that I really like to make. Speaking of darker moments, I just saw the trailer for the crossover yeah. biological terrorism yeah. uh, arc. Uh, what was it like uh, pulling back for both of you guys? Like, how intense was it? Well, it was uh, pretty intense. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. I mean, we're still filming. It. We just we're got yellow still, yeah. pages for our script. Uh -huh. We've been working every weekend. Our poor crew. Like it has been. I'm. I'm just so glad that the episode that this trailer looks so cool because we put every ounce of blood that we yeah, have into no, the show. It, it, it was. It's been a long month. Also, but also, it does yeah, look like it paid off. It, I know. I'm pretty excited. Uh -huh. I've heard rumors that ours is really good, so yeah. I'm really excited. <laughs> I mean, there's no competition between the shows, so we're all equal. But hair I'm not kidding. <laughs> good cover. Yeah, thanks. Hair is really good. Um, there's also like in this, it's uh, biological warfare, and they add effects afterwards. But the makeup doesn't. Does, makeup does like 75% of the ad, but like even up to 75%, it's really gross. I was like, I have to film the scene, but every time I was like, what if Burgess just threw up? <laughs> like. Does that take away her badassness if she's just like, what? No thanks. <laughs> it was nasty. Yeah. There were some things that I don't need to see again. Yeah, like upper thighs gone. Oh, oh God. Face. I had a, I had just had a scene in fire where someone's face was gone. <laughs> yeah. No face. It's like a horror movie. It is a horror movie. Mm -hmm. But awesome. <laughs> yeah. But they looked like they were having a good time. But we had to... So... Uh, Tracy's character brings to mind. Sometimes you forget because you're having like, such a good time and you forget that you're actually filming something. And Tracy's character brings tamales and she's like, Tamales from Mommy Gar from Mama Garcia's. And I took a bite. And after I took that first bite, I was like, I'm going to have to take a bite for the next 25 takes. <laughs> I was like, Oh, great. Upton tamales. And then I'm like, I'm screwed. It was just really, it was really yeah. fun. It was great. It was, it was a fun day. A lot of extras. It was great. Um, so another question, just, so fans are dying to know 
is Bursic ever going to happen again? Like, is there, you know, obviously you finally broke up with Upton last season, but, like, what is happening between you guys or, like, as in terms of, like, a romantic relationship? Bursic will happen again this season. Okay. Um, so we're excited about that. We didn't really... Yeah. We should talk to somebody about, about what, what we're allowed say. to say. <laughs> well, it's gonna something's going to happen in the crossover, so I feel like whether... Whether it's Endgame or not, I don't know, but right. they'll they'll explore it again. They'll explore something again. I think you know, Ruzek. She's just the great love of his life. You know what I mean? And so whether or not they're together, there's just always that thing. Yeah. You know. And I just so we'll see. We'll see what happens, but it definitely. We start interacting again, I guess, yeah. is, is a good way we're to We're talking. Work. We're talking. We're dealing with we're each talking. other. We're just, like, we're just seeing how things go, you know, how things pan out. <laughs> also, we've been filming out of order. Right. So we did episode eight, where something really big happens, before we did anything else. <laughs> so it's like, it's actually a little confusing. We're not quite sure what's what going What airs on. and what yeah, order. Yeah, so we think something's happening. <laughs> we'll see. Gotcha. Yeah, it's a little... Uh, it's a little confusing. Yeah. <laughs> it's a little confusing. Yeah. Does that make it harder for you guys as actors to prepare, though, when you have to shoot, like, episodes out of order and, like, know what's it's coming? It's frustrating. Or? It's not harder to prepare. It's just a little frustrating. Yeah. I mean, what was kind of nice about it is this this thing that happens in episode eight, we could make the request, like, you guys have to give us... <laughs> some build-up. Some build-up to this, this situation. It can't just be... Right? I mean, like, that's yeah. nice. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And they were like, oh, right, okay. <laughs> So, but it is a little tough going all out of order and shit. Yeah, like, it's like, I don't do know I like you now? Out. Do I not like yeah. you? Oh, How do I feel about X? I don't know why. So there's also a new character coming in. She's um, the worst. <laughs> she's not charming <laughs> oh, or cute or just, adorable or really good at her drag. job at all. Yeah. yeah no, I know. I feel like no one expects to say that. She's terrible. Right. She's amazing. She's wonderful. <laughs> oh, we love God. her. She fits into the group like a dream. Yeah. She's a kind person and really great at her job, so she's fun. Fantastic. Let me just show you what I think of her. Okay. Wait, 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 wait. <laughs> That's how I, when I think of was that. She's so cute, like, yeah. <laughs> she's just so adorable. Yeah. It's it's and it's fun to see someone like <laughs> experiencing it like a baby for the first time. Oh, like, for sure. Yeah, you gotta say all those lines. Yeah. <laughs> In or like yeah, it's just like what she say the other day, she was like Oh no! Oh, I wasn't I, in it. I, was, I wasn't in it. <laughs> and I was like, "What do you mean?" I mean, we're literally just like, like saying like a street name to Void, you know, like just yeah. giving him information. She's like, "I wasn't, I wasn't in it." <laughs> I don't know. She's like, "I wasn't feeling it." She's like, we're "Oh, like, honey, you got to release yourself from that." Yeah, <laughs> you just got to say the street yeah. name and move on. Yeah. It's a there's a marathon. We're not sprinting. <laughs> yeah, yeah. You got to you got to release yourself sometimes. She's so great. Yeah, yeah, she's awesome. I wasn't in it. <laughs> That's a pretty good impersonation of yeah, her she's too. She's really cute. Yeah. Question because I know um, Dick Wolf is here today. But, like, I love how he's like, in case you didn't know, <laughs> he's right that's there. That's him. <laughs> yeah. Like, how often does he like? Does he come by the set often? What's it like working in his like little universe? I guess. Um, he doesn't come by set a ton. No, if he does. Normally, when we see him, it's uh, him buying us all dinner. Yeah. <laughs> which I'm okay with. Which is which is very yeah. very nice. Of him. No, I mean it's. You know, he's got the formula down. So it's he trusts his people. He trusts his people. I mean, he's actually a really nice guy. <laughs> you would think that somebody that high powered would be like, you know what I mean? I like, have time for millions, yeah. But yeah. he's actually a really lovely guy, and I don't know. It's what? How do I put this? He's just got the formula. And so being a part of it, you're like, you feel like well taken care of. Does that make sense? Like, like he's kind of got it under control. I just got to do my, my little my little bit. Not worry about the rest. And not worry about the rest because they kind of just, they got that figured out. Yeah. Bridges and Ruzik are both still cops. Do you guys hope that they'll take the detective's exam sometime soon? No, we always toy around with that. Like, we wasn't, never. Yeah, we we said it? the exam was coming up, but I don't know. <laughs> I think we all failed. Yeah. Well, there's that, but like, wasn't Royce like last year? He said Void 
like put him up for a detective. But then we never did. Did that happen? Anything. I don't yeah. remember that. I, vague, vague, something like He's, that. He tells me about it. He's like, I put Atwater up for the detective exam or why, something. Why not me? <laughs> well, that was the whole scene. Was I was like, oh, fine. Like, what about me? Mm-hmm. But then I don't think he's a detective. I don't know. <laughs> it's a very good question. Yeah. And one that I think I'm going to ask our writer. I feel like I've asked every year. My mom is like, why aren't you a detective? No. <laughs> like, I'm sorry, mom. I'm trying. I'm trying. It's hard. It's hard out there for a PO. <laughs>